Prize to start things off. Organizers say Art Prize is going to be returning in 2022. They had planned on having the larger Art Prize happening every other year, if you remember, with the smaller Project One on the off years. So in the fall of next year, downtown Grand Rapids will once again be full of art. Organizers are going to announce the artist and venue registration dates soon. More details coming in a few weeks about the grant program and the prize format. All right, keep that cash at home, Whitecaps fans. LMCU Ballpark is moving to cashless transactions in 2022. That includes parking, concessions, retail, hospitality decks, and the four top seating areas. The team's vice president and general manager, Jim Jarecki, says their goal is to make transactions faster, more convenient, and more secure. I mean, most of the time we don't seem like we have cash on us anyway. Uh, I have $10 in my pocket pretty much at all times, but that's all the cash I have. <laughs> <laughs> Everything else is like a debit card or my phone. And that's Monopoly money, so. Yeah, yeah you know. God, it's not even real money. Uh, Mary Freebed and Saginaw's Covenant Healthcare are opening a new $41 million hospital. You're getting some time-lapse video there. The new 90,000 square foot facility is designed specifically for rehabilitation. It will have 60 private patient rooms, therapy gyms, a bionics department. That's cool, bionics. bionics. And much more. They'll be hosting a virtual ribbon cutting on the Mary Free Bed Facebook page today, just after our show at 10.30. All right, we know that Uptown loves to support local art and has commissioned several window muralists who have set the scene already throughout that district. On December 2nd, watch live as a new mural takes shape. Artist Jamari Taylor of July Artists Art Studio will be painting and creating a masterpiece beginning at 6 p.m. at Root Functional Medicine, located in the East Hills District. To learn more, just head to uptowngr.com. You can see it when you go on the Shop Hop. Yep, and the Shop Hop's always a good time. Mm -hmm. Hey, don't forget that Thanksgiving, you know, okay, it's in the rear view, but you may have some leftover pumpkin pie, apple pie, pecan pie, any other kind of pie. Today is Pie Day, National Pie Day. Actually, it's National Pie Day Part 2. The mm -hmm. pie celebration on December 1st today is the second observance of pie during the year. Mm -hmm. According to nationaldaycalendar.com, the more popular National Pie Day is on January 23rd. So we got another one coming up next month. Bake it up, slice it up, gobble it up. Uh, blueberry, sweet potato, pumpkin, pecan, all the different pies. Any way you slice it, it's a nice way to get through a Wednesday. I thought Pie Day was... was um, 314. Yeah, March 14th, because 3.14, right? Can we have three pie days? For those who love pie, Yeah, any eat, days. eat my day. slice. Absolutely. <laughs>